Hello, welcome to New Life Scientific. I'm Steve. Uh, today we wanted to show you off a, a unique piece uh, we, that we got in, a Spencer sliding microtome model 860, um, sold and marketed by uh, American Optical uh, out of Buffalo, New York. Uh, as I said, this came in um, on some surplus equipment we got in. Um, I'm a big fan of working on microtomes. So I couldn't resist um, this unit. Uh, it needed a lot of, uh, of attention, a few parts, uh, but got the thing uh, back together and uh, actually working very well. Um, goes back, this design goes back to pre-1938. Um, we're guessing this was made in the 50s, um, maybe right after the war, uh, the 40s, late 40s into the 50s. Um, as I said, it's a, uh, a Spencer sliding microtome, and as the name suggests, um, it does its cutting by in a sliding motion. Uh, when you go back, the click you just heard is it raising uh, the, the specimen to the knife, and as you pull it, it will slide that up and if I had a brush I could get that and I don't have the, the sample well surfaced yet but as you can see it's doing a nice uniform cut. Um, this one has the uh, ice, the uh, dry ice uh, so uh, it'll harden up your sample a little bit more. Um, gorgeous way it's, it's designed and built. Uh, everything works nice and smooth very easily. There's your micron adjustment. There's, we're going out to 10. We were up at uh, uh, what appeared to be two microns. Um, there's 10 and all the way out to 40 was this adjustment. Uh, there's your uh, manual raise um, uh, lever there. So when you pull it, it's actually raised that uh, uh, knife up. You can also change the attack of the of the sample, or the knife actually. Um, samples don't attack, knives attack. Anyway, by moving your, your levers, there I'm having to loose, because this is a counter, is sort of a balance system, you have to loosen some up to get others. And as you turn of the source, you're seeing that uh, move then in your various directions. Um, so fully articulating, um, this is not all original equipment. Uh, we did have to uh, manufacture some items, um, uh, which was mostly these two knobs here. Um, there are some videos of this, not, not one of these running, but with the proper knobs in that. But a nice little system, full, like I said, fully working. Um, we can... Uh, you know, change the angle of attack on the knife by using this knob here. It'll change your cutting, your, your blade angle up and down. As you can see it there, it is a balancing act because as you do one something with one, you have to uncounter it with doing something on something else. So when you want to change your, your blade to get to a new sharp section of the blade, you can do that as well. Loosening up the levers, sliding that along. So you can be refreshing your blade length, your blade, your, your section of where you're on the blade. Um, you can change your angle. Um, of attack, and you should tighten this down before doing that. So you can change your angle, tighten it down, uh, and then you're going to cut a little different angle onto it. Now, of course, I've done all that moving, and so anyway, um, and tighten this down. Uh, nice little unit. Um, it will make a, a, a nice museum piece as well as actual a working microtome. Um, so. If you're interested uh, in, in the history of the sliding microtome, there's one to take a look at. Um, for more information, 
uh, you, there's a lot of information on the web about it, and you can uh, contact us at New Life Scientific. Thank you very much.